a world redeemed by Joseph Horatio chant this world is but the shadow of the world that is to be, a ripple on the surface of a deep, unfathomed sea. God's plans are always perfect, but long ages intervene from the planning of the temple to the glow upon its sheen, but we can be co-workers in accomplishing his plan, for in God's purpose is a place for every son of man. The germ may be developed in a more salubrious clime, all obstacles surmounted in the onward march of time, and nature's forces harnessed will their destiny fulfill, and things now deemed supernal respond to human will. For God has so adjusted the laws of this earthly sphere, that by man's help his plans unfold, and order doth appear. The words of God's own prophets concerning these latter days of mighty transformations, to our great Redeemer's praise, when wastes shall glow in beauty, and the savage beast be kind, though they have prior fulfillment in the realm of soul and mind, will then be more than figure, though that we all count sublime. The earth will wear its regal robes in every land and clime. This life is but a sample of the life that is to be. There we know the perfect lesson, here we learn the A, B, C, and the life beyond is fashioned by the thoughts and deeds of this, fitting it for realms of darkness, or for never-ending bliss. For those alone will sorrow who receive his grace in vain, but those who wrought with God will prove that godliness is gain.